Hey everyone, Kita Sean here. So as expected, after the third anniversary for Fate Ground Order USA, the revival of Dead Heat Summer Race, the Ishtar Cup of Hopes and Dreams 2019 Light version is finally coming back. It's going to start on the 17th of July and end on August 1st. So you still have a couple days before this event so that you can, you know, farm the third anniversary, get those EXPs, level up your servants. Uh, run through the main story get those courts etc so you still have a couple days take your time but um once the 17 starts you guys are going to be grinding the next couple of months because after this summer event most likely the next summer event is coming so uh, be prepared for that but let's go ahead and talk about the event a little bit because i'm pretty sure there are some new players and some players that need some refreshing so let's go ahead and talk about the event so the event is going to be a two-part event dead heat summer race and dust summer escape so it's racing and escaping from prison most mostly racing but basically here are your six teams that are participating and what you want to do is cheer them on by clearing quests and then you want to also use some items so that you can cheer them cheer them on even more and give them an attack boost when it comes to quick arts and buster and of course there's going to be four different rounds so each round will unlock as the next, uh, the previous round ends and then Ishtar will temporarily be added to the servant pool uh, which you can actually use for free and then uh, later on you'll be able to fully unlock her so that you can keep her forever but there's going to be a list of servants here that will get a bonus from this event so make sure you have those in your teams and put them on your support and then of course the items here which you can exchange for items in the item shop and then of course ce's that you can use you can get free ce's you can get gotcha ce's so make sure to pick up all those if you already have them then you're good to go but uh this one seaside luxury is a great one pick that up use it so that you can um, get a bunch of drops and then of course again ishtar is going to be your welfare writer pick her up if you did not pick her up last year she's actually a really really useful aoe writer um, so definitely pick her up and then her materials to a center so make sure to pick those up as well now uh, you have her mp we're not going to watch that you can watch that yourselves and then here is the list of items that you can exchange for and then uh, you can get a bunch of mono prisms and exchange for exp so make sure to do that if you really want exp but let's go ahead into the gotcha so this is gotcha part one there's going to be a second gotcha uh, once the uh, second part of the story unlocks but gotcha part one has Nero caster Nero chris assassin frankenstein saber and Oda nobunaga berserker this is a great banner to roll on i think all these servants in this gotcha are really really good uh narrow caster great aoe buster attacker uh farming caster nido chris is a great farming uh assassin as well frankenstein is a great single target saber that's a quick type and she gets a huge buff with scotty releasing and then nobu is a you know a heavy hitter when it comes to her noble phantasm as well um I highly recommend rolling for this if you do not have any of these servants they're really really good uh but I totally understand if you want to save your court for the next summer event, but uh, Nero Caster, it's going to be a while uh, when you see her again, and um, Frankenstein and Nidocris, uh it's going to be a really long time for them to come back. I mean, I don't even think we have a rate up for them. So, uh, Nobu Berserker, she will come back eventually in Gouda events, so you don't have to really worry for her. I'm pretty sure for those who are going to roll for Mao Nobu, then you'll eventually roll into you know nobu berserker but scrolling down a little bit uh here are your rate updates so make sure to roll on a day that you want to uh roll on so that you can get that specific servant and then you know previews of the servants and the ce's all these ce's are actually really useful uh, especially summer little and uh, white cruising i think these two are really nice i especially love the design on uh, white cruising but yeah these are great ce's to pull for and uh, part two is going to have some really good ce's as well and uh, some great servants like Saber Alter, uh, Ryder, Raiko, uh, Lancer, Helena Archer. They're all really great. So that's basically about it. A quick little overview. Uh, again, all you got to do is cheer on your favorite team, have them win the race so that you can get some more items, uh, exchange, farm, just basically normal event stuff uh, again just make sure to get ishtar rider i think that should be your main goal just to get ishtar rider more than anything but other than that uh, that's basically about it again um, most likely the next summer event is going to start right after this so be prepared to be grinding a lot these next two months and then most likely after that you'll be getting uh, more events so again it's going to be grinding hell these next couple of months so uh, be prepared for that and uh, hope you guys uh, enjoy 
the rerun. So thanks for watching, and I'll see you guys in the next one. Laters.